welcome back again friends on moodle tutorial for developer in this series we will start from where we left okay so as we see in our last video you are not able to upload the file okay so let's check the last step we did in our last video again so this file is not here Browsing. Okay, again, it's the something went wrong. So I have added here the message. Okay, you can see the message. If file is not uploading, uh, we just assign in a variable. We have seen this in previous video. And if not, that means nothing is coming inside this variable then print this okay so again we can see the image not the sorry the file not uploaded yet okay so let's try to debug this okay so on model enable developer debug mode okay so come here <clears throat> you can enable like this but uh, there is in Moodle there is predefined thing so I am checking for that <clears throat> okay so although this will work so let's just go paste this one inside the config i already have this one but this is just for your reference i am just going and pasting this okay so in display debug we should have e all means everything like debugging developer not okay it is not recommended for production server okay not even the enabling debug mode on production server so let's try to upload again just refreshing here taking the file uh, yeah save changes now you can see the no such file or directory okay so that means the this upload variable we are referring here is not able to access okay so this there may be issue of this slash slash so let's remove first and try again okay so you can click on continue here you can still see there is no files <coughs> Simple file, click on upload and this one. Okay, now there is no error message. So, ideally, the files would have been uploaded. So, it is here. You can see. Okay, let's rename it to this one and comment out this debugging mode message setting and refresh again and try to upload again one more file okay let's say the word file so this empty document okay so empty in, in model empty thing will not work so let's try it this okay after click on save no message is coming no failed message coming that means the file has been uploaded okay so you can see here clear so i think you hope you have understood the code how to use this file picker to upload a file okay same way you can you can use this variable path to insert into the db also okay so thank you thank you for watching